Hi, Sagittarius. This is Jeffrey. This is Ripe Color. And this is your weekly reading uh, for the week of, I didn't even check the calendar, uh, the 7th through the 14th. Wow. Okay. Um, please like, subscribe, share, comment. Press the bell for notifications. I'm offering 30-minute uh, readings for $30. Is below. It's currently snowing, but it's not sticking. But it's pretty to look at. All right, let's see what's going on for Sagittarius for this week. I know I'm a little late. I usually do these uh, the day before, but I didn't get to it. One, two, three. Maybe I should just move the cards. That'd be easier. One, two, three. Okay. The four of wands, the two of swords, and the eight of uh, pentacles. Okay, so I think this is going to be a week of choices. I think this is going to be a week of choices regarding um, maybe where you live or how you live um, and your stability, uh, your stability as to uh, what makes you I think your stability, okay, this is about choices, right? And it's in the middle. And yeah, you know what it is? I, I think that the, the whole message is um, don't fall into black and white thinking. Don't fall into um, oh, it's gotta be this way, and it's and it and you know I I it's about being adaptable. It's about being adaptable and saying, okay, I'll see what happens, right? Because um, this concerns your stability and your uh, like how you live and where you live, and who you're living with. And there, there's something about um, either where you work or how you work or what you're doing for work. And there's, there's, I feel like this is kind of the week of the year, really, where you're making decisions about your work life, your, um, what makes you feel at home um, what makes you feel stable, how you approach work, uh, how does work fit into the rest of your life? It, it's like that. But uh, the thing is, um, you know, so many times we have plans about oh, well, I'm going to do A and it's going to lead to B and then B leads to C and, you know, and sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes A leads to G, which leads, which goes back to C, which goes, you know, it's not really linear. So I think it's about sitting with yourself and deciding what's important to me, what's not important to me, what makes me feel, um, happy, comfortable, stable, um, and how can I get to work on that? And how can I get to work on that? So I think that's what the week is about. But like I said earlier, what's happening this week is that there's a stellium. A stellium means that there's uh, more than three planets in one sign. And it's all coming through in Aquarius. They're like, 
don't even know how many planets, six or something. It's crazy. And because it's Aquarius, it's going to be very mental. There's going to be a lot going on in your head. So let it all come in and then sort it out. But that's what I'm saying. Let it all come in, thinking that, thinking that, da, 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 da. And, um, you know, it's going to take a little while to sort it out. So allow new thoughts, new ideas to come in uh, from yourself, from other people, from your surroundings. Um, and then let, let it all come in first and don't get all, um, it has to be this way, it has to be that way. Be more fluid. Anyway, that is my take for you for Sagittarius for this week. If you want a one-on-one, -on -one, all the information is below. Thanks for coming and take it easy. Blessings.